Well, this morning I saw six deer, two bucks, maybe a doe, and three hey, other. You didn't know? So, Purtis Creek, here we are. Yep. Doing our annual walkthrough. Walking around. I say annual walkthrough. Like, <laughs> like we've done every this time, every year. Every year. I think it's our first time. We've maybe. never been to Purtis Creek before, so. Maybe our first and this our is last. The time to... Yeah, look at that girl. <laughs> Please don't shoot me. This park is known for bass fishing. Or fishing in general. Yeah, or... but really bass fishing. Oh, okay. Good thing we're not fishermen or women. Yeah. We're not fisher folk. It's about 90 miles from Dallas. Another good lake if you're looking for something near the city. This park only has one campground, but they have almost 60 sites. Almost 60 because the number stops at 59. Right. <laughs> they have water and electric here. Is that no all? full hookups, no but full they do hookups. have a dump station and the dump station we passed it last night coming in and it's looks really nice for, for a dump station. For a dump station. But just having one is always uh, a plus. Here comes our little archer daughter. <laughs> now we're down here at the old fishing pier. We're just gonna walk down here real quick, take a sneak peek maybe. You can tell that they really value fishing fishing, and the fact that people want to fish here just based on like the amenities that you get. Let's get on this trail. Watch those roots. They'll get you. I'm coming. Sorry. She's gonna go check out the bird blind. We have to check this out. I'm checking it out. See ya, deuces. Are there any snakes in here? Yeah, you come into a blind like this, there's gotta be some snakes in here. Look at this thing. Something like went into the water. But I couldn't tell what it was. Not a bird. A snake. It was probably a snake. Maybe. An anaconda. Uh, I watched a movie one time about anacondas. They'll eat you alive. That movie wasn't real. Oh. I thought it was. Are you going to tell me Jennifer Lopez doesn't know about anacondas? No birds, no anacondas. Told you. Nothing. Okay. You all right? Tired. Already tired? Well, it is, you know, 11 o'clock. Snack time. What you eating? Granola bar? A s'mores granola bar? Mm -hmm. That's the best. This trail is a nice nature walk. It is a nice nature walk. Besides that, it, I mean, it, it is what it is. Like, I mean, it's, it's not anything exciting. It's just a nice nature walk. Yeah, it's the trail. <laughs> it's the trail to get to all the primitive sites. Yes. So. Don't do this. Don't walk around the campground and then do this trail. You'll get extra tired. You'll get extra tired. <laughs> mm -hmm. But maybe you want those extra steps. Yeah. 
Definitely doesn't have some of the views that we've seen in the past. Yeah. I mean, there is like, look, like you can look out onto the lake and that, that's probably the highlight. Y'all like my hat? Most definitely. Is to be able to do, to do that. But besides that. The old jacket hat. The lake is definitely the key feature to Purtis Creek. Oh, you want me to hold your trash? Mm -hmm. After you ate your snack? Uh, let me do that for you. So we're here at the Texas Freshwater Fisheries in Athens, Texas. Yes, we came here because, you know, Curtis Creek is such a huge fishing destination right. for the area. But they actually have some sort of freshwater fishery. Yes. Is it a museum? Is it a park? Is it an aquarium? Is it's, it a mark? It is part of the Texas Parks and Wildlife Division. Okay. Great. So, awesome. Yeah. So. So we're here to look at some fish. Yeah. I hope today is going to be a fish day. Holy moly. Oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. It's like a swarm. They're like, ah. Hi, 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 it's easy to see over here, Keegan. His eyes are above the water. Uh, Can you see the tail? Oh, yeah, I see it. See him? You I see, see it? it? I see it. I see it. He's little. I see it. Oh, my gosh. I was thinking he might be like a big old alligator. I had to zoom in there. Oh, man. Do you see it now? My eyes hurt now. <laughs> Your eyes hurt? Yeah, that thing is tiny. That thing is tiny. It's tiny, tiny. Well, let's go look at these fish. Holy moly. Ah. Oh, my word. Goodness, Keegan, look how big these fish are. These may be some of the biggest fish I've ever seen. Yeah. Is it the biggest fish you've ever seen? Yeah. This is crazy. Who knew all these fish were in Texas? Look at that train. Look at that tram. Oh, snap. Right there? Yeah. What do you think we're going to do? I think we're just gonna drive around. Yeah, we're just gonna drive around and look at stuff. Maybe they'll, maybe they'll tell yep. us some stuff. Surely. Have you ever tasted the vanilla? I don't like it. It's not very bad. It's not a bad one. Put those in a coat. Acres of ponds total on crop feet. And we actually put anywhere from 100 to 125,000 fish fry per acre of pond out here. That was fun. So we took the tram to the drop off. Yeah. We, the, well, we did. They gave us, a, you know, like the a option. little tour. Yeah. yeah they, they give you a tour. They show you some of the ponds, yep. and then you have the option of taking this little 15-minute hike. Yeah, a little trail back, back trail. to the visitor center. Yeah. So, so we're gonna take it. You're so excited about walking back, aren't you? No. <laughs> we already walked too long. Uh -huh. Why is there a giant hoop? So we're here in the duck blind. Ever been in a duck blind before? No, I have not. First time ever, duck blind. <laughs> well, now we've got a 15 minute walk ahead of us. Yeah. Someone's super excited. This one. Yeah. <laughs> Enthusiasm is so high right now. I see on the lily pad. That's the only thing I see. What is this? Yeah, lily pad jungle? A lot of lily pads. Some serious lily pads. Maybe too many lily pads. Think there's an alligator in there? Probably not. Yeah. At this point, we haven't gone through it all yet, but here in Athens, Texas, if you're ever going to Purtis Creek State Park, highly recommend coming to the Texas Freshwater Fisheries. Yes. Pretty cool. How much was it? It, really it was only is. like. I think it was. It's like five dollars for adults and three 
fifty for kids or Let's something call it like that. Just Thirteen. Very 50. reasonable. Very reasonable. Yeah. Especially yeah. since like if you wanted to fish, they'll like loan you stuff and like we the tram didn't cost any extra. Like everything's included. Yeah. There's like a dive show, but we missed that, so yeah, we can go fishing if we want to. Keegan, you want to go fishing? Try to catch something? Let's try to catch a fish. Apparently, the specialty here is is bass. Yep. Bass fishing. Nature Communication Center. That's a whole lot of sounds going on in here. Apparently you can come in here and just push a lot of buttons. Yeah. We're at the bee house. Oh man, this is scary. Are you gonna go in? Or are you gonna uh, stay up? It's a whole lot of bees. Yeah. This may be the smallest bridge ever. Covered bridge. Well, I think we found the fishing area right here. I kind of don't really know how to do this. You're supposed to hold your, supposed to hold it down like that, and then you cast. Just let it go like that. This is the area of the center that you can fish at they have a building where you can get a reel and a rod is it a reel and a rod run reel you can get a rod and reel they'll loan one to you it's free and they also give you some bait the bait's already gone someone ate the bait already yeah someone already ate the bait <laughs> wrapping up the old texas freshwater fisheries we already finished oh did we well, I'm just saying, it was uh, pretty decently. It was. Well. I was surprised. Good experience. Yeah. All those words. Mm-hmm.